Oh, hey, Stuart, I got you a little souvenir from my trip to space. Wow. <laughs> Howard, it's very nice of you. Yeah, maybe. Open it first. <laughs> it's my official NASA portrait. <laughs> to Stuart, your comic book store is out of this world, just like the guy in this picture was. <laughs> For the record, he also thinks the Walgreens and the dry cleaners are out of this world. That's not true. At the Walgreens, I was over the moon for their store brand antacids. Boy, it's nice to sleep in a bed with gravity again. Did I tell you about the night my retainer floated out of my mouth and into the airlock? Yeah, you mentioned it once or twice. So? Here we are, just a couple of young newlyweds. <laughs> what to do? What to do to you? <laughs> Astronaut Wallowitz reporting for booty. <laughs> Preparing thrusters. We have liftoff. <laughs> Are we clear to jettison that nightgown? Okay, we need to talk. <laughs> what? Uh, Howie, I know you went to space, and I'm incredibly proud of you, but you might want to try and not bring it up every minute. I don't talk about it every minute. <laughs> Tonight at dinner, you went on about it for an hour straight. What was I supposed to talk about? We were eating at Johnny Rockets. <laughs> Just saying, people are getting a little tired of it. So... I did this amazing thing, and I'm never allowed to mention it? Of course you can, but maybe a good rule would be to wait for people to bring it up. Okay. <laughs> no problem. It won't happen again. I love you. I love you, too. Bernadette said you guys are all sick of me talking about my trip to space. Is that true? Yes. No. <laughs> Uh, we seem to have different approaches here. I was going for helpful honesty. I have no idea what you're doing. It's called being nice. Okay. If you think being nice will get him to shut up, I'll try it. You know what, guys? Never mind. I just won't talk about the greatest achievement of my life ever again. Yeah, but look at that. The problem solved itself. <laughs> You guys look adorable. Thanks, so do you. Slutty cop? No, sexy cop. Slutty cop only came with a skirt and two badges. <laughs> Sheldon, get in here. Can you believe Stuart's walking around taking credit for this party? Who cares? What do you mean, who cares? Look what I pulled off here. The, the DJ's on fire, there's a TARDIS photo booth in the back room, and oh my god, the food. Stuart wanted Kraft, Draculoni and cheese. <laughs> You're right, the party's fantastic. Please, tell me more. I haven't heard enough about it all week because hearing about that never gets old. Is this about the space thing again? Well, I'm not allowed to talk about it, but since you brought it up, I went to space. Space, 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 space. <laughs> Oh, drinky smurf. <laughs> Can I talk to you for a second? Right now, I'm in trouble. You are being very rude. No, I'm not. They're all being rude, and you're being rude. Me? What did I do? Oh, hell we... <laughs> Stop talking about space so much. Nobody likes it. I don't sound like that. <laughs> You're my wife. You're supposed to be on my side. I'm always on your side. Then why are you trying to take this away from me? You know, being an astronaut is the coolest thing I'm ever gonna do. And if I stop talking about it, then I'm just... Just what? Just plain old Howard Wallowitz again. Plain old Howard Wallowitz is the best guy I know. You're just saying that. No, I'm not. I married him. On purpose. <laughs> Come here. I love you. I love you too.